Here is THE basic rule for anyone who wants to play as GLA. You select GLA, you get ready to rush the enemy. You don't want to or you ain't good at it, then select another faction, that's how it is. Why? Unlike USA and Chinese faction in comparison, GLA has NOT the same chances of winning a late game. You might have noticed this in skirmish 4v4 battles, that the GLA are ruthless in the beginning, but if the game gets, say, 1-2 hours long, their defeat is inevitable. But, with the correct build order and micromanagement, they are overpowered on early game. This is why you must rush. Cheap units plus fast production equals rush them. Allow me to demonstrate how. Well, you know what they say, first things first, so here's the build order. Supply stash, barracks, arms dealer, tunnel network. I will work. Do not hurt me. There's not enough room for that building. Don't get too much worried where you place your buildings. The important thing is, is to get them up ASAP. Does it have to be so far? I will work. I do what I, I am told. finished with the building. That is what you want. I'm I hungry. Work. Does it have to be so far? Are there not better tools? Cannot we live in peace? I am finished with Once the barracks are up, get two RPG troopers and start building the tunnel network between the barracks and the arms dealer. We are not I'm just a peasant. When the arms dealer is up, get the technical out and ready 4 RPG troopers and 1 worker to board it. Those 4 RPG troopers are the 2 that you build from the barracks and the 2 extra free that come from the tunnel network. Well, for some stupid reason, these dudes didn't want to get into the technical, but it's okay, I just sent them anyway. So we should board those guys, but you can't waste time on rushing, so if a bug happens, just forget about the bug and go for it. As you can see, the enemy has nothing to prevent this attack. Now, this is an all or nothing move. Get the worker out ASAP and have him to build a tunnel network next to the barracks and have the RPGs to target dozers. Don't worry about any infantry coming out from that barracks, just have that technical standing by and run them over if needed. Make sure none dozer gets out of there alive, target them before they can start building anything. Soon as that tunnel network is up, you have a straight passage to the enemy base. Ready some scorpions to ease your task. Now with the situation under control, you can start targeting the production buildings. Barracks and war factory, if there are there. I will do my best. And now it's only a matter of time. Victory is yours. I sense danger maybe near. Scorpion tank. A warrior has fallen. We fear nothing. We are going. Hang on. Might be a fresh line. Good idea. Land must be preserved. We take what we need. Hang on. Load it. Our will is strong. Scorpion tank. Very well. Fast as I can. They must die. The tunnels will protect us. Our land must be preserved. The light tank of the GLA. Hang on. 
In the GLA underground. Scorpion, ready to stick. The cannons will protect us. Try my chances. Shh. I sense danger. I will do my best. At your request. Fast as I can. <laughs> now tell me how hard was that? Well, maybe you like to mess around like me in skirmish battles and sometimes you want to use bomb trucks and such. Or maybe you want to use general disease on challenge mode and rushing is not possible naturally. Well, if that's the case, I will cover what you can do on part 2.